this. Absolutely not. Ohio State having a great season last year, looking to sneak into the Big Ten tournament with that was Wisconsin, Indiana. They've done really nice things possessing the ball. We'll see if they can finish it off. Here come the Buckeyes now in the corner, crossing into the mix. It falls, but the touch just not quite on there for Parker Grinstead. Just as we teed it up. College Cup in 50 years back in 2018. Haven't quite been able to replicate that success in the last few. But certainly has done an excellent job. Cross swung in, headed away. Now up in the right corner. Ball laid off. He's got a four of fires, but it's high. Here come the Buckeyes again. A little fake there. Cross it in, header towards goal. Oh, what a save! Absolutely brilliant by Zach Kelly. Coach Damon Rensing has called him the leading candidate for goalkeeper of this season, and Zach Kelly shows us that right here. Full stretch, full extension, not only getting two hands to it, but able to hop on the rebound before Grinstead gets his foot to it. Phenomenal angle here from our team. Great job by Zach Kelly. With the edge here in the early going, four to one in shots. Ball laid down the side. Grinstead with a cross. Rolled all the way up. Ends up laying it back. Tons of space for Addy Dukin, sends it across. Head early, have created quite a few chances. Here they come again. Ball laid off, cross sent in. Cleared away. Fielder has been outstanding for the Buckeyes this season. Can he make an impact here? Cross into the area. Second ball touched, blocked. Roberts chips it in, headed away. Second ball brought down by the Buckeyes, laid off. Addy Dukin. Addy Dukin cuts towards the end line, sends it across. Oh, and it's bad and high, but the rebound is put home. There's the opening goal. Luciano Picota puts it away for the Buckeyes. 1 0 Ohio State. Twenty-five minutes of sustained pressure by the Buckeyes, resulting in the first goal here. Ade Dukin doing a nice job getting end line. The save, amazing by Zach Kelly, unable for his Spartan defense to clear out that opportunity. Again, we see the left palm there striking it away, but Pakota right there. Johnny Ade Dukin manages to turn. Now he has space in front, lays it off. Crossing in, that up the confidence factor. Exactly, from not being able to execute recently. Adedukin somehow is able to come up with that ball. Wooten shoots, sent away. Rebound. Out to Sam Ways, sends in another cross. Wooten trying to break free. This one chipped towards the far side, headed away by the Spartans. Elios trying to bring it back down under control in the corner. Again, Ohio State side of the Spartans. Buckeyes have it back though. Laid off in the corner. Instead, sends it across. Second ball, and that one goes in. It's a second goal for the Ohio State Buckeyes. Two nil, the lead. We've talked about the sustained pressure of the Buckeyes, again coming from a wide service. Attempted clearance there by Cromer. Ball hit back into the box, and sometimes it's better to be lucky than good. Borkovic getting his left foot on it, hitting off the Michigan State defense. This one in play. White jerseys lined up on the far side of the 18. Sharp fires it in. Bounces through everyone, almost looked like it was going to bounce in. Ends up going wide, but didn't look certain that Max Trejo was ready to put it in the mix. Sharps crosses low, but it's saved. Trejo has it. Minute and a half to go. This one chipped in. Ederson back in the mix. Corner sent in low, near post, headed away. Second ball sent high, off his line, it falls through. 
Trejo initially got a touch to it, whistle did blow, and the halftime buzzer sounds. So the first 45 in the books, the Ohio State Buckeyes with a 2-0 lead. Anything differently you would have liked to see there on that last sequence from Manil managed to come back and, and get that 2-2 two -two tie scoreline after a, a couple of goals. Gets it back with space on the right flank. Sharp sends it across, dangerous area, still bouncing. Run down by Stout. Two defenders on him, manages to split them. No whistle. Ball still up for grabs. Couple players go down, multiple players go down. This time the whistle blows. There is some protesting here from both sides. A lot of contact in the box. And I think Coach Sergio Gonzalez is going straight to VAR, video assistant, because there was so much contact. We saw a couple bodies go down there. It looks like there definitely was a kick by Grins. Last sequence you just saw, the official review is going to be underway. Take another look to determine exactly what is the right call here, Chris. And again, Michigan State, Ohio State, all over the place. Kerrigan, he just shot against Northwestern. Low to the goalie's left. Will he do that again, or does he switch it up here? Kerrigan yeah. shot, and he scores! Michigan State pulls one back. It's his sixth goal of the season. See the Red Cedar Rowdies trying to get this crowd animated and amped up. Trejo did his homework knowing that Kerrigan went to the goalkeeper's left against Northwestern. Too good, too perfect of a shot. 2-1 Ohio State over the spark with this momentum. Tough play there by defender Elijah Howe for Michigan State. But the pass out not on target. Trying to send them back 2-2 draw so certainly he's a player you got to keep an eye on on set pieces and in the run of play and here he gets the ball again sharp tries to get the shot off this time trying to break through here spatafora going in line gets the cross off not able to convert them how can they get it up the field to create nice move shot deflected out of play Good looking opportunity there from sophomore Jonathan Stout. Stout doing a nice job avoiding the first Buckeye defender, seeing what's in front of him, taking the shot on goal. Good defense there by Ohio. Sharp sends it in towards the penalty spot. The second ball off the crossbar. Still loose, cleared away by the Buckeyes. More Jonathan Stout, I want to mention he was the Big Ten co-freshman of the year. However, here come the Buckeyes on the attack. Oh, that's a great cross. And the shot somehow sent away. Are you serious? Wooten, so close. Put in towards the near post, headed all the way through. Ends up bouncing out of play. Lays it off, crossing in, dangerous area. Second ball, shot high. Close calls for Ohio State. Sharp sends in the cross. Header towards goal, just touched away. Michigan State still in the driver's seat. Another cross sent towards the middle. Spatafora lays it off. Cross sent in. There is a collision, no whistle. Ball goes all the way through. Coach Brian Mazenoff says he likes Max Trejo and goal. Spatafora running it down into the box. Spatafora connects. Mercer. Shut down. Sharp tries it himself. This shot takes a couple deflections, goes high. 
Ohio State reeling right now. They're not getting their outside mids back and defending. You see six, seven Buckeyes in the box, lunging, leaning, trying to make sure that shot doesn't go on. Sharp with the corner. Sends it in. Punched away by Trejo. Clearance, though, not on. Second ball fired in, but the header is high. Frustration there for the Spartans as they are knocking on the door. Mercer wants that one back. Trejo getting the ball out. Wooten unable to clear it. You see the look of disgust on his face. Great ball into the back post. Trejo flying to make a save if he had to. Unable to connect. Back and play quickly. Spadafora lays it off. Shot is high. Another close opportunity for the Spartans. Coming off of the throw-in, we see Kerrigan setting it up for Spadafora. The shot just blazing over. We see from behind the goal here, great opportunity for the freshman Ludwig, unable to put... Goal score for the Spartans. Ball out wide to Sharp. Cuts middle. Sends it across. Last touch by the Buckeyes, but falls through. Oh, nice move. A second nice move. Stout. Oh, no, 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 the door. And it's the equalizer. This Michigan State team now going down without a fight. Undefeated for a reason. 2-2 in East Lansing. Coach Damon Rensing with the sub, bringing Stout off the bench. We see the ball circulate going from right to left. Stout chasing it down. Sees one Ohio State defender getting by him with ease. Second one with ease and then putting it on goal. Go Able to then make sure that that rebound knocked off him into the back of the net. We see there Trejo unable to come up with it. It's down in the corner now, little bump. Still on the dribble, though, is Mercer crossing in. Little miscue. The shot, though, dribbles into the hands of Trejo. With it. Big ball over the top. Mercer running it down. Mercer into the box. Approaching the goal. It's sent out of play. Whistle blows. Mercer also took a little knock there as he was approaching the 18. Turn there. Nadukin. Guys, now with a lot of numbers forward. They wanted the handball. Entry pass. The shot just dribbles off of a couple of feet before going out of pat matchup. Also going to have huge implications. That'll be airing right here on the Big Ten Network. The shot across. Somehow. Adedukin sends it in. Curling. Punched away. Second ball. High and wide. Another substitution made for Michigan State. A lot of subs through this match. Space on the left side for Picota. Into the 18. Cuts right. Yeah! It's beautiful. It's brilliant. Ohio State takes a late 3-2 lead. What a shot by Luciano Picota. A brace for Picota, and could that be it? What a strike by Pakoda. He's done it all afternoon from the left hand flank, cutting into his right foot, and a laser. Zach Kelly has no chance. Beautiful job getting the defender off balance onto that preferred right. Zach Kelly even screened. No chance to get that ball. Pakoda knows they're 329 away from guaranteeing themselves. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Sharp can't believe it. The ball by Kerrigan in through. He's on goal. Trejo does a nice job of getting big. Still in no man's land and just unable to put it on frame. Two feet to the right. And we knot it up at all three. Great angle here. Unable to find the back of the net. 
Michigan State so close to keeping the unbeaten streak alive with an equalizer just moments ago. Now just 14 seconds remain. This ball sent forward out of play. Less than 10. There it is, the final buzzer. This matchup officially in the books. It is a massive upset for the Ohio State Buckeyes.